In this video, we're going to talk about your website complying with the Americans with Disability or ADA Act. What this means is basically your website has to be accessible to people with disabilities. So somebody who may be blind or um, somebody who is um, physically impaired, it makes it easier for them to read and move around on your website. And this is a law that went into effect that you need to pay attention to because it's important that your site is compliant. So what we've done is we've given you an easy way to make your site compliant. We do um, do some of the things that they ask us to do, like add alt tags and title tags to images and things like that, but there's a lot of things that we can't really do. So the easiest way to handle this is to add a plugin to your site. So you'll notice within your site, if you go to plugins, there is a plugin called Accessibility by UserWay. And once it's all set up, the way that this is gonna look is, here's my website, for instance. Up in the top right-hand corner, you're gonna notice that I have this little icon with a person. And when I click on it, it gives that person abilities to, for instance, uh, read the page out loud and change the text size and things like that. It makes it ADA compliant very easily. So this is really easy for you to set up. What you're gonna do is you're going to come into here and you're going to go to settings and then you're going to go to user way this make sure that this plugin is installed in your site if it's not then you can come over here to add new and just type in accessibility put by user way make sure you get it this is the plugin right there and make sure you install it and make it active once it's active then you go to settings and you go to user way and you're simply going to fill in your email first name last name and your website URL make sure if your website is HTTPS that you do include the whole URL in here and then save changes. Once you save it, it's going to say that it has completed and it's going to give you a little code. Then you're going to get a bunch of emails. So the emails are going to tell you how to use UserWay. And one of the emails is going to give you a password. You don't need the no branding version. You can just use the regular version that's free. But look for the version that does have a password. Once you have that password, go back to your site. You will automatically see the icon in the top right hand corner. You can click on it and then right here you're going to click on manage and you're going to put your email and your password in here and click on login. Then what it's going to do is it gets going to give you the ability to edit the plugin from the front page of your site. So for instance, if I wanted to remove the user way branding, which is this right here, I could pay for the upgraded version. Same with the donate link. If you want to change the button color, you can click here and choose a different color. You can also change the button type. They have different types right here. So if you wanted to use that one, you could. See how it noticeably changes already. If you want to change the button location, I can, for instance, change it down here in the left. And there, now it's over here in the left. Uh, if I wanted to change language, if I was in a different country, uh, the statement link. There is an embed script that you can use, which you won't need with this plugin, and you can change your password to uh, administer to these. So once you're all done, you can go ahead and log out, and that's it. Now your site is ADA compliant, and you're good to go. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call or shoot us an email over at support at yoursiteneedsme.com. We're always happy to help. Have a great day. Yeah, battle! Yeah.